record. Oh, and come on. There we go. Perfect. All right. Good morning. Happy Monday. Um, okay, so today is weights day, so you'll need some weights. And I also have a band in hand as well, just uh, in case. All right, so let's start off with big warm up with big arm circles all the way up and around. And let's go the other way. Two and three, and let's do the other arm. Try to exaggerate that movement. Range of motion is what we're going for. And the other way, one, two, and three. And let's put our arms out nice and wide. Roll your shoulders back nice and relaxed. Rib cage up off that hip bone. And uh, let's just do a couple arm circles here. One, two, three, and let's go the other way. All right, as we're reaching for those opposite walls and we're gonna bring our left arm all the way across for one, two, nice big deep breath out as you're coming across. And let's go the other way. Couple pulses back, feel those shoulder blades being pulled together. One, two, three, and four, and shoulder rolls all the way up and around. One, two, and three, and the other direction. One, two, and three, and reaching nice and tall. Let's just reach over to the one side. Oh, that's a nice stretch for me today. And over to the other side, that tiny little bit. And all the way up to the sky and six full body squats. Let's come down those side walls. Booty goes back, collapse it down. Squeeze the glutes at the top. Nice big breaths. Squeeze those glutes, wake them up. And let's just do one more, reaching for those side walls, collapse it down and up and coming all the way down. All right, three air squats backwards. One, two, and three, and let's go forwards. One, two, and three, and let's go the other way. So I am away for the next 10 days and forwards. One, I sent you guys recorded um, videos. Awesome. And let's go all the way up on our tippy toes. I just sent you a variety of them. I had to send you two emails. All right, down on one heel, up on two. Because I accidentally sent it. Just pushed the wrong button. So I sent you two emails with some recorded. And you can always go to YouTube and see a different one if you like. All the way up, squeeze and down. All right, and let's roll those ankles around. And rolling, rolling, rolling. And the other foot. And the other way. All right. And a big shake the room. Shake it up. Wake it up. Woo, woo, woo. Do, 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 do. All right. So we have three exercises. It's Jack's Day. Everyone loves Jack's Day. So we're doing jacks. Then we're going to do alternate jacks jack knife, and then down on the mat for plank jacks, all right? You can step them out or you can jump them out in plank, okay? 
All right, so we're starting off with jacks. And I start with stepping it out just to warm it up. Rib cage up off your hip bones and belly to your back. Do, 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 do. So I think I lost my sunglasses on the weekend. So I have to go off to the store to get new sunglasses unless I find them within the next two hours. Not happy. But that happens. All right, alternate jack. So reach up to the sky, belly in, knee on the opposite side, on the outside of your elbow, on the other opposite side of your knee. Reach and bring it down, belly in. So you're really pulling your belly into your back, crunching that nut right there in that belly button. Nice. Big little breath out as you're coming down. Two and one. So we're going down to plank. On your hands or on your elbows. Set. Shoulders back. And you can jump it out. Or step it out. Or do a mix. So your elbows are underneath your shoulders. Belly to your back. Don't forget to breathe. Haven't done these in a while. And we're back up to jacks. All right. I'm jumping it out this time. Looks like it's going to be another beautiful day. Seven, five, three, and one. Alternate jacks. Come on, keep that belly pulled in. Have that twist. Work those abs. And if you really were wanting a bigger workout, you can always put weights in your hands. And you could also jump it up a bit, step it up a bit. Two, and down for plank jacks. Always form comes first. Get set, put those shoulders back. I'm jumping it out this time. And do the alternate back and forth. Got to sit in a plane for hours and hours and hours tomorrow. I may as well be. Have a good workout today. Back up. Come on. We're up to jacks. Palms up this time. Push it. Push it. Push it way up. Come on. Push. I have to remember it's Monday. I'm always a little bit of breath on Monday. All right, alternate jacks. Woo hoo! Crunch it, crunch that nut, guys. It's in your belly button. Crunch it. Five more seconds. Two. And we're down for plank jacks. Woo! All right. I'm stepping it out this time. Push that heel back to that back wall. Lengthen your body. Head going to one wall. Feet to the back wall. Belly to your back. And breathe.
And one, we're back up to jacks. Palms coming down. Have a little push, push it right down. Working those smaller muscles as well. Three, two, and one. We're down. Oh, no, we're not. Alternate jacks. Woo! I'm dry. <laughs> Woo. <clears throat> Very dry. <laughs> Three, two, one. Now we're down. Plank jacks. <clears throat> Push those shoulders back to the sockets. And we're back up to jacks. Come on. Uppity, 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 uppity. Let's go. Thumbs up. Do, 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 do. Five. Three, two, and one. We're not done. Alternate jacks. Woo! Oof. Have that twist. Try to get that elbow on the outside of that knee. Punch it. And one, and we're done. Woo! Good stuff, guys. Woo! That was a Jack's day. That's what Jack does. All right. Always on weight days. We do our uh, deadlifts. Oops. So grab your two weights for deadlift. You can do deadlift upright row, bicep curl, whatever you like. All right. Shoulders rolled back, rib cage up off your hip bones. Soft bend of the knees, hinge at the waist. Snap it up. <sighs> You're just grazing the front of your legs. And your back is nice and straight. Head is in line with the spine. Squeeze those glutes at the top. Anywhere between eight and 15, depending on your weight. Form always comes first. I'm gonna do one more. One more. Awesome. All right. We're gonna do front lunge, side lunge, back lunge, fast feet, and then the other side. All right, so if you want, you can grab weights. I'm gonna grab some weights. All right, we'll see, I may change that. All right, so 
right leg first. So you're going to do front lunge, side lunge, booty back, back lunge, one, two, three, four, five, and then other side, front lunge, side lunge, back lunge, one, two, three, four, five. Your, your body is very tall. Right, your chest is open. You're looking at me. Booty goes back on that side lunge. Last one on both sides. Whoops. Glad I just got this lighter weight. Woo! Booty back. Back lunge, 90 degrees, both legs. All right. If you can, you want to leave those two weights, we're going to do curtsy. All right, so if you need lighter weights, change the lighter weights. Start with swinging your arms all the way up and around, and then curtsy down. Reach for the sky and collapse down in that curtsy, keeping that belly pulled into your back. We're doing eight, that's two. Reach for the sky, crunch it down there in that curtsy. That's five. Six, two more. Seven, woo! It's a roller coaster, woo! And eight. Oh my, okay. I'm out of breath. Okay, we're gonna do chest press, eight chest press, or yeah, eight chest press, fly, flip it over, eight push-ups. okay? So grab your weights and we're gonna get down on the mat. So let's do chest press. All right, because we're gonna do a superset of the Chest, so when you're down on the mat, belly to your back, go up into bridge, push it up and back down. One, coming up over your chest. Two, get that bridge nice and high. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, then put those weights down, flip it over, eight push-ups. Military on your knees, doesn't matter, right? Shoulders are pushed back into their sockets. Push up from the palm of your hands. Shoulders are pushed back in their sockets. Four, five, six, seven and eight and flip it over. We have one more set. You can switch it over to uh, um, flies if you like, which is the two C's or chest press. All right, back up one, we're doing eight. Two, get those hips up. That's eight. Safely put those weights down to the side and then flip over to your push-ups. You're not in any hurry, guys. We're here for an hour. All right. Shoulders are pushed back into the sockets, belly to your back. One, two, 
three, four, six, seven, eight. And go into child's pose from there. Nice stretch in the arms. Walk them over to the right. Have a nice big deep breath in and out. Walk them over to the left. Back to center and roll. Bring those hands down the mat. Up your quads and roll your shoulders back. All right, let's put those weights away. Because we're back to our cardio. We have jacks and alternate jacks starting now. All right, 30 seconds of jacks. It's supposed to be a little cooler all this week, about 2022. Nice, nice weather. Hopefully where I'm going, it's gonna be a little hotter. I read anywhere between 20 and 28. 25 would be nice. All right, alternate, alternate jack crunch. Reach for the sky, crunch it down. Belly in, come on, crunch that nut. Ten more seconds. Woo hoo! Now we have one more set of this. Two and one. Jacks, last time. Keep that belly pulled to your back. Come on, get those muscles all engaged. Ten more seconds, guys. Three, two, and one. Last time. Alternate jacks. Come on, we can do it. Crunch it down. Come on, we can do it. Last 30 seconds, 20 seconds to go. Woo! 10. Five. Come on. Two. Woo! All right, grab a drink. Woo! Oh, lay moly, Monday morning. Monday morning, work it. All right, one weight in hand. We had side crunches to go. We're gonna do 10 per side. Reach up to the top. Okay, get that belly pulled in. Point that right toe in. Crunch it to the side. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other side. And 10. Awesome stuff. All right. <clears throat> we have our front lunge, side lunge, back lunge, fast feet. So grab your weights. Roll your shoulders back. Standing nice and tall. Chest is open. That's how I want you to be when you're going into your lunge. Front. Side. 
back, last feet, other side. Last feet. Doesn't matter how many fast feet you do. Whatever feels good. One more per side. Last half. And end with fast feet. All right. We are going to do reverse flies. All right, so um, weights in hand, shoulders are rolled back. Okay, nice little uh, chair seat. Bring your um, weights in front of those toes and lead back with your elbows. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Belly to your back. Anywhere between eight and 15, depending on your weight. Guess I'm doing 15, I got lighter weights. Awesome stuff. All right, we're down to Russian twist now. So grab a weight. All the way down. All right. So up and down, up, then twist. Come back to center and then roll it down. Keep that belly pulled to your back. I'm doing a little different. I'm going right, left, right, left, and then I'm going down for my crunch. Just something different. I just tried it. Keeping your belly to your back. Follow that weight with your hand, with your eyes. I did not count at all. I'm going to do two more. All the way up. One more. And I'm done. Woo! All right. Good stuff. When you're done, grab a drink of water. All righty. Then we're switching over to power yoga when we're done. When you drink, have your band at, at uh, near you. And well, we'll be doing weights. Um, we're gonna be doing some uh, glute bridges, so. Oh, hang on here. I can't talk. She should know that. Mm. My sister calling. Bobby is telling me to have a good trip. All right. Make sure everything's all put away. Have your band in hand, standing at the end of your mat. We're going to go all the way up, reaching for the sky. Reach, reach, reach. Let's reach over to the right. Over to the left. 
all the way up and coming down those side walls. The rag doll. Soft bend in the knees. Pulse it out. And find that lowest vertebrae. And then let's roll it up. All the way up. Over your shoulder blades. Roll your shoulders back. And let's come all the way up to the sky again. And all the way back down to rag doll. Walk your hands out to downward dog. Let's push away from those from your hands. Activate those shoulders, belly and hips being pulled up to the sky, and you're pushing your chest to your knees. Sway side to side, just your lower body, keeping those shoulders nice and still. Push away from those hands again. We're going to raise that right leg all the way up high behind you. Three kicks. Bend that knee and look underneath your right shoulder, reaching that knee to that back wall. Feel the stretch. Straighten that leg all the way out. And we're going to bring it all the way through to our right thumb. You're in low lunge, grab your band. Place it around your, uh, your, your hands and we're gonna go up to high lunge, belly to your back and we're gonna go up and down for six, five, four, three, two, and one, and then just come in to for bow and arrow. Shoulders are pushed back, hand pointing at that upper crotch, elbow is up, and lead back with your elbow for one, two, three, four, five, and six, then roll your shoulders again, come shoulder height, elbow is up, everything's just below shoulder height, and bring that elbow back. Five, four, three, two, and one. And just drop that down to uh, the your uh, floor, come back to high lunge. We are going to come down those side walls to either side of your right foot. Come back to high plank. Push those shoulders back into their sockets. Plank twist to the right. Plank twist to the left. Let's do four mountain climbers, bringing those knees into your chest. Two, three, and four. Push back to downward dog. Push away from your hands. Raise that right leg up high behind you. And we're gonna bring it through to your right thumb. And we're coming up to warrior one. So bring those hands in front of your right foot. Power up of a nice little back arch to warrior one for five breaths. Pull those palms together as if there's magnets there. I want those breaths coming all the way into your belly. Follow that breath down the nasal path all the way to your belly. And then exhale. All right, let's bring that right hand down to your right foot. Lengthen your left hand up to the sky. Reach for the sky and reach down to the ground.
All right, let's bring swing that left arm back and around, coming up to your right hand, reach for the wall in front of you. You're looking straight down. Your neck is in line with your spine. Power up. Back to warrior one, two cactus. Nice and slowly bringing those elbows down to your waist. Bring your hands back to your chest. Little finger push-ups. Twine those fingers. Push down to the ground. Activate those triceps. Reach for the wall in front of you. Power up again. And back to warrior one. And let's bring those arms all the way down. Side walls down to either side of your right foot. Bring that right foot back to your left foot to Chaturanga. In four, bringing those elbows close to your side. Three, two, and one. Let's push our chest up. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Relax those hips. Come all the way back down to the ground. Push up to high plank. Belly to your back. To downward dog. Pushing away from your hands. Push your chest to those knees. Belly going up to the sky. And walk those hands all the way back to your feet. Bend those knees and roll all the way up. Roll those shoulders back. One, two, and forwards. One, and two. Let's bring those hands all the way up to the sky. Reach, 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 reach. And down those side walls to ragdoll. Same thing on the left side. Walk those hands out to downward dog. Push away from those hands, up on those knuckle pads. I want you to feel those shoulders activate. Your chest being pushed to your knees. And then let's bring that left foot high up behind you. Three kicks. Bend that knee. And look underneath your left arm. Straighten that leg out and bring it all the way through to your left thumb for a low lunge. Grab that band again, place it around your knuckles and power up to, more, uh, to uh, high lunge. And we're going up and down for six, five, four, three, belly to your back, two, and one. And then just turn that back leg for bow and arrow, but I want you to make sure your shoulders are back in their sockets and relaxed. And then lead with your elbow, one, Two, three, four, five, and six. Always with the band, hold it back there on that extension for a second or so. Roll your shoulders back. Everything's at shoulder height or lower. And one, two, Three, four, five, and six. You can drop that band, come back up to high um, lunge, and we're going to bring those hands all the way down either side of your left foot. Bring that foot back so we're in high plank. Shoulders, push them back into their sockets and then plank twist to the right. 
plank twist to the left to downward dog push away from your hands chest to your knees get up there on those uh, knuckle pads and let's raise that left leg high behind you and bring it all the way through to your left thumb and we're going up to warrior one from here hands in front of your left toe reach for the wall in front of you power from that quad up to a nice back arch to warrior one and breathe okay. Bring that left hand down to your left foot. Lengthen the sky and to the ground. Lengthen those arms. I know you probably hear my phone dinging 100 miles an hour. I have pickle ball players, golf players, and my trip girls digging me. All right. Let's bring our right hand down and around, coming to our hand out in front. Power up to warrior one, to cactus. Nice and slowly squeezing those shoulder blades together as you're bringing the elbows all the way down. Hands come to your chest. Couple finger push-ups, move those fingers. Have a little finger war. Entwine those fingers, pushing down to the ground. Activate those tries. Push towards the wall in front of you, looking straight down at your left toes there. And then power up. Warrior, warrior one. And let's come down those side walls, all the way down to either side of your left foot. Bring that foot back to high plank. Push those shoulders back into their sockets. And we're going down to Chaturanga. In four, three, two, and one. Push your chest up. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Right, coming all the way back down to the ground. Push up into high plank. To downward dog. Push away from those hands. Your ears are at your biceps. Sway your bottom side to side, keeping those feet flat on the floor. And this time, let's walk our feet to our hands. All right, uh -huh. belly to your back, walking your feet to your hands. Bend your knees, arms are spaghetti, and roll all the way up. And roll your shoulders back. Two and forwards. One and two. All right, we're gonna go down onto uh, the mat and do our glute bridges. So you can either do them with a band or a weight. Totally up to you. Today I'm going to use a weight. I like to switch it up every now and then. So first off, just set that weight down if you're using a weight. If you're using a band, right above your knees. Just above your knees. Let's measure up fingertips to heels. And your knees should be about hip width apart. If you're having a weight on your hips, just make sure you're hanging on to that weight so they don't fall off. All right, so we're in, ready to go. We're gonna go up and down for eight, squeezing those glutes, pushing from your heels. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, and eight. Hold it up there. And we're going to open our legs and close them for eight. One, two, I want you to squeeze from the, your hips, the outside of your legs, not your knees. Six, seven, and eight. Stay up there. We're gonna put it together. Down, up, open, close. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Five, don't forget to squeeze those glutes at the top. Six, and you're, when your legs are coming in, you're squeezing from the outside of your legs. Last one. All right, and staying up there, let's bring that right foot all the way up to the sky and down and up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two and one, leave it up there, up and down for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two and one. And bring that down and come all the way down. Have a breather. All right, we're gonna go and do the other side now. But same thing, up and down for eight. One, two, three, come on, get way up there. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Stay up there, open and close. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Stay up there. Bring that left foot up, sole of your foot, pushing the ceiling up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And eight, and up and down for eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome stuff. Just take that weight off or the, the band off. And let's bring those knees into your chest for a nice hug. And a roll side to side. Woo! Awesome. All right. Um, let's lengthen our right leg and hug our left. Bringing that knee to your left shoulder. Lengthen, hold it, and switch. Lengthen that left leg. Hug that right and switch, keeping that belly pulled to the back, and switch. And we're just going to roll all the way over into table, tabletop. All right, get into tabletop, hands underneath shoulders, knees underneath hips, and your knees are coming right from your hips. Three kicks of your heels and make a wish for today. All right, wonder if you know what I'm wished for. All right, we're going to do um, eight hydrants. All right, so bring that knee up and down for eight. Belly to your back, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, and one. Eight hydrant kickouts. Out and in. One, two, three. Keep the belly pulled to your back. Four, 
five, six, seven, and eight. We're not done. Lengthen that leg out behind, toe pointing down. Six rainbows. One, take a look at your toes. Two, on each side. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And then leave that foot out to the side on the right side, directly from your hip. Have the outer edge of your foot pushing into the floor and slowly just sit down onto that left foot, coming all the way down, bringing your forehead down to the mat and keeping that outer left right foot on flat on the floor. Have a big breath in and out. And then just come all the way back up, bring that knee down and we're gonna do the other side now. All right, so hands underneath shoulders and knees and eight hydrants on the left side. One, keep the belly pulled to your back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, eight hydrant kickouts. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Extend that leg out behind you, toe pointing down. Rainbows, one, two, three, Four, five, keep the belly pulled in. Six, have a look at those toes when they're touching on either side. And eight, extend that leg out from your hip on the left side, outer foot on the mat, and then just slowly sit down. with a nice big deep breath in and out. All right, come back up to table and go into plank. We're going into pigeon from here. So let's go up to, I like to go, go to pigeon from plank, right? So I bring my right knee into my chest and then I bring my foot across the mat Lie my knee down. High pigeon. Going down to mid pigeon. I'm on my forearms. And then bringing my forehead down to the mat to low pigeon. And I want you to stay here for four nice big deep breaths in and out. And when you're done, bring that leg back to the other leg. So you're in high plank again, belly to your back. Bring that left knee in and across the mat. You stay wherever you are comfortable in your pigeon. You can also use a yoga block in this as well, or a pillow. And where you are, if you are wherever you are in your pigeon pose, four nice big deep breaths in. And as you're breathing out, you're going to sink further into that stretch. So feel that nice 
Add a little stretch at the as you're breathing out. Awesome stuff. And when you're done, let's just roll up to sitting position. Let's extend those legs out in front of you. Roll those shoulders back. Sitting nice and tall. Let's bring those hands all the way up to the sky. Have a couple pulses reaching up there. Bell your rib cage is up off your hip bones, right? Your core is engaged. And let's walk those hands down the ceiling to the upper crotch, down the wall, reaching for your feet, looking down at your knees. So your neck is in line with your spine. Go down as far as you can and then hold it. And then just collapse down for two nice big deep breaths in and out. Come all the way back up and roll those shoulders back and let's sit cross-legged from here. Putting a little pressure on those knees to open up those hips. Switch feet, and same thing. Take your left hand, place it over top of your right knee and look behind and have a nice big deep breath in. All the way across to the other side. back to center and let's just bring our hands back behind us and let's just do a couple knee taps pushing your hip flexor up towards the upper crotch there and since we're down here let's stay let's do three um crazies all right so bring that hand sweep it around look way back behind you reaching for that back wall and around that's one uh, two and three and then just switch legs One, really lengthen everything in your body when you're looking back there, stretch it out. Two. And three. And when you're done, let's go lengthwise on your mat for three rock and rolls to rag doll. One. Two. And three, going up to rag doll. Fold your hands and just breathe. Feel the stretch all the way. You can slice, sway side to side. Nice big deep breath in and out. All right, hands or spaghetti, move your head around in a circle, move it around the other way. Same as your wrists, soft bend in the knees, belly to your back. Find that lowest vertebrae. Let's open it up for the day and start rolling up. Straightening your legs first, belly to your back. Coming up over our shoulder blades. And then roll your
your shoulders back and forwards. I gave a big old shake of the and shake it up, shake it up, shake it all up. I'll see you in two weeks. Have a great two weeks.